Today on The Daily Dose, Ho Chi Minh. Born in 1890s central Vietnam, as a young man, Ho Chi Minh found work as a chef on a French steamer, spending several years traveling to Africa, the United States, and Europe, settling in France by 1919, where he organized a group of Vietnamese expats to petition delegates at the Versailles Peace Conference for improved human rights under Vietnam's French imperialist overlords in Southeast Asia. Inspired by Vladimir Lenin's Bolshevik Revolution, Minh joined the Communist Party in 1920, founding the Hong Kong-based Indochinese Communist Party in 1930, before traveling to Russia, Brussels, Paris, and Thailand as a representative for an international communist organization. During World War II, Minh returned to Vietnam, organizing the Viet Minh Party, or League for the Independence of Vietnam. Attempting to seek financial aid from China, Minh was thrown into prison for 18 months by Chiang Kai-shek's anti-communist government. Following Japan's surrender and withdrawal from Vietnam in 1945, Viet Minh forces seized the northern city of Hanoi, where Minh was declared president of the new democratic state of Vietnam. War would break out in late 1946, after a French cruiser opened fire on the town of Haiphong, leading to years of guerrilla-style warfare during the First Indochina War, until France's decisive loss at the 1954 Battle of Dien Bien Phu. The Americans were next in the Cold War battle against communist expansionism, sending the first aid and military troops into South Vietnam by late 1961. Known as Uncle Ho to his people, after Minh stepped down as party secretary general to take on more war planning behind the scenes activities, when American airstrikes escalated substantially in 1965 and 66, Minh sent an open letter to the people of Vietnam, stating that nothing is as dear to the heart of the Vietnamese as independence and liberation, which soon became the motto for the North Vietnamese cause. He passed away from a heart attack on September 2, 1969, four and a half years before the fall of Saigon, making Ho Chi Minh an essential figure in Vietnam's push for independence. And there you have it, Ho Chi Minh, today on The Daily Dose. Get your nerd on with The Daily Dose. And if you enjoyed today's episode, share the link with a friend or colleague so that they too can learn something new every day.